another Minecraft video, and today I'm going to be showing you guys some of the tiniest houses in Minecraft. So before I get into today's video, make sure to go pound that like button. Let's aim for 2,000 likes. That would be flipping amazing. Also, while you're down there, make sure to go comment tiny house. That would let me know that you made it to at least 10 seconds in the video, which obviously is an accomplishment to some people. But anyway, guys, without further ado, let's get into this tiniest house Minecraft creation. Now, the first creation is actually what inspired everybody to sort of kind of go with this trend of tiny minecraft houses so the original creation i'm not entirely sure who made this but i think it was a pretty big french youtuber called zendak he made a video about this and he didn't credit anybody in the video but he had a download and also in the kind of tutorial on how to install the map it said that the tutorial was by him so i'm gonna just assume that he made this map but obviously if someone else made this map please feel free to let me know also if you speak french uh here's some signs for you in french i don't know what anything means in french French, but yeah, uh, let's just move on from that. Once we go over here, you'll notice that there it is. One of the tiniest houses in Minecraft. Now with the texture pack, this house looks extremely amazing in my opinion anyway, especially with shaders on. Everything just looks great. Now it is just one block tall. It's one block wide, you know, one block long. So it's literally just a little tiny house that is one block. It's kind of insane. It's also on this neat little pedestal thing that makes it look 10 times better. And look, it has a chimney. It's made of wood wood and it just looks crazy so you'll notice that you know we can't really open the door we can't really interact with this but if i walk forward into the house bam look at this we are now inside that same house uh so over here we have a little kitchen area he also retextured some of the wood in here to look like cabinets uh, sadly you can't interact with them obviously you can interact with the furnaces you have your own little carpet uh you also have i think this is supposed to be a tree i mean it, it looks pretty nice i'm not gonna lie you have a fully working enchantment system right here you have some chests in here but i mean the whole point of this is that it's just a neat concept where you can have that little tiny house and then bam we are in this same exact house but obviously we either shrunk down or the house got a lot bigger so you'll also notice if i look outside everything is the exact same so if i look over here we're gonna have the same exact hills if i look back that's where we came from in the beginning we have the same lights and everything uh you'll notice that we also have flowers over here which is nice and if we go upstairs this is the tiniest two-story house i've ever seen in my life look at it, it has so much living space we also have a, a diamond stand up here with all of our diamond armor and we also also have some beds over here so we have a fully fledged house uh, with some great decorations we also have a TV which I didn't even notice till now that looks great so there's a bunch of customly designed things in the house which makes it just that much better but you'll notice that if I walk over here open the door and walk outside we are back at where we started and bam look that's a little house that's where we literally just came from so if you're still confused about how this is working let me do something real quick let me turn off my chat settings so let's make the chat shown and bam when I walk in here now you'll notice in the bottom left corner it actually says that i teleported somewhere so if you guess that this is actually a totally different area then you were correct uh if you want to get out of this building you actually cannot go back through the door uh that area is actually the teleportation device so you're going to want to go to the side you can break out the glass and bam look we are outside now the entire structure is exactly the same uh in terms of you know the terrain the waterfall all the lights and lanterns but the only thing that changes right here is the house so you'll notice that even if i walk into the House like this it'll teleport me back uh, and that's pretty much how the entire system works now the system is based off of the teleportation device that is right there i think it's like underneath the house so i can walk into that from any single direction and then if i go over here you'll notice that we have a complete replica of the entire creation where if i go down here it's the same exact structure and everything and this is the quote-unquote tiny house that we were just in it's actually just a big giant illusion this new creation is based on minecraft command blocks so you're not going to have to download anything crazy so i'm gonna head over to a new world and show you guys that right now so guys now that we're back in a new world i'm gonna be showing you the second tiniest house in minecraft but for me to be able to spawn this one in i'm gonna need a command block so for those of you who have no idea how to get a command block well it's pretty dang simple we're gonna do slash give your in-game name so mine's beckbro jack then we're gonna do c-o-m-m hit tab and bam you get yourself a minecraft command block now you're gonna go in the description down below if you do want to download this and uh, you're going to copy and paste the command inside of the command block and then 
then next you're gonna go over here to hit needs redstone and you're gonna hit always active and once you're done that you should get the structure spawning in wow that almost just crushed my whole entire body all right so essentially now that you have this you can get rid of your command block and you're gonna need to get yourself an emerald and also some bricks for this so yeah once you have these two items you're gonna throw them down on the floor and bam you will get your mini house spawn egg so you can put this anywhere obviously because it only is gonna take up one entire block so let's put ours right here. That's where I'm feeling. Oh, there it is. Look, now it is a little bit glitched out because uh, I have shaders on and my shaders is weird. But yeah, you'll notice that if you do walk into the house, you are teleported to, I mean, inside the house. You're supposed to be inside the house, but uh, it actually teleports you in the air. Now you'll notice that this house is definitely not as nice as the last one, but it's still an amazing concept. And I cannot wait to see what else is going to be done with this. I mean, I could see like malls being created. I could see other types of of houses being inside of houses so like you could have houses inside houses i could have like a mini house right here i could have like my beach house i could have like a modern house i could have a redstone house i mean the possibilities with this are just insane now you also get some storage and you get a furnace and you just get the basic necessities of life but then if you do want to exit back out you're going to open the door run and jump down and then you'll fall down but don't worry you won't take any damage unless it glitches out so you'll also notice that if i spawn in another house let's just say over here spawn one in and then let's walk inside the little brick house and then if i look out the window i might be able to see the other house uh nope can't see it we're gonna have to spawn another one we oh my gosh that hurts all right so here you'll notice that i actually almost collided the houses together uh yeah the other house is literally right there let's go into game mode one let's just bust through the other house look at that there's another house right here now if i actually bust out of this entire thing and go into game mode one you'll notice that they actually actually do spawn in the sky if i go right down below you'll be able to see the mini houses down here they correlate with the house in the sky so if you spawn one in right here it's going to spawn all the way up in the air and you'll just be able to see it you won't really be able to make out what it is it almost looks like a little cloud up there but yeah it definitely is a very neat concept that i cannot wait to see what different things will be done with it in the future but yeah anyway guys that is pretty much going to wrap it up for today's video i really hope you guys did enjoy enjoy if you did make sure to go pound the like button and also make sure to go comment down below tiny houses but anyway guys that is pretty much it my name is beckbro jack and i will see you guys all next time goodbye